Hello, hello, and welcome back to Sim Airport, where we pretend to be an airport manager. So we are building up some of our gates so that we can get reserve gates. So my idea is to get reserve gates here. So I'd like to make these three reserve gates because there'll be enough room. So as you can see here, we don't have a lot of room. So I'm going to make a common seating area here for this and this. This is a large gate. Large gates essentially for us have two check-in counters. And this is an extra large gate, which means it will need four check-in counters. So we'll need substantial queuing space over here. I think there's enough room for people to sit down. Nobody's actually sitting down all over the place. If not, we can just have seating areas down here. As far as the queues are concerned, we will have to have queues over here. So I am going to have gates here and queues there. So let's get windows here. like so like so and then let's get the foundation going over here let's go down let's dismantle some of these walls I like to dismantle these walls too because we need to get gates here but the queues here are going to be challenging here here and here the queues will definitely be challenging because we cannot get queues this long we'll probably have to like make them snake around It's just some designer windows, some sunlight trapping shoots of extreme heat and hellish fire. See, this is what I'm talking about. We wasted so much room here. If we could just copy paste this room over here, we'd have enough space for at least half as, you know, queues that are half as long. But we wasted that room. Why? Because we expanded from being a small airport to a large airport. Now on the other hand, if we start planning, assuming that we are going to be a larger airport, things will definitely be much better. Let's look at our cash flow graph. Look at this. 7 million on this day. We made 3 million. 11 million on this day. We made 3 million again. So we're making around 3 million, 3 point something million. This is, I guess, a true representation of how much money we make, which is around 700,000. Yeah. 700 to 800,000 around. Wow, 100 workers are still slow. They're not fast enough. Uh, we need a bunch of hangers here for sure. We might need a baggage place here. So let's go down. If we get baggage here, we will need to connect it to this hub. Of course, we can have a smaller hub here which connects to this hub, but I think we can just directly connect it to the hub. Shouldn't be much of an issue. So let's get baggage. We can get two baggage depots here. Just double up on it. Right, so that's a good bunch of baggage shoots. So which means we will need a hub here. So let's get a hub here. There'll be two outs and two ends. So I'm going to assume these two and these two will go here. So this will go to connect to this one here. It's all one to one connections. There's no cross docking. Which kind of bugs me there was it would be much better 90 percent capacity well it's just 3 a.m so look at that cancellation fail to reserve runway cancellation fail to so this is one thing i don't understand when they say fail to reserve runway are they saying the runways are not enough or are the gates not enough because we have 
why are we getting runway delays we should not get a runway delays 47145883 we don't have a lot of simultaneous flights so if we look at this list we don't have more than four simultaneous flights i'm sure oh god things they could do to make some of these observations easier hmm sai 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 is there some tool in the operations menu you know it's 82% i think we might be able to push this up a little bit let's try and push this up to 50 see how low this goes okay so they seem to have finished construction on everything including this so the baggage depots are done okay we can join them together i guess right let's just dismantle it and try we'll dismantle this and then we need to get a foundation here let's get it all across here and also like so let's have a little bit of room to work with and this is going to go down here so Yeah 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 I know you're not connected Maybe we should get big hangers here I don't know if it's cheaper or not but maybe Right right flight status uh X1 got cancelled this was X3 got cancelled so all the X gates are getting cancelled I hope it's not because we don't have enough runways. I mean, we could get more runways. One more that got cancelled. Is it? We could go back and we could reset all the flights. I guess. Okay. So let's go in here dismantle all of this and see how these flow So if these conveyors are not going to work like this too many consumers okay what's the error is it too many consumers again
Okay, this might not be sufficient. We might have to get one more over here because these two can just go straight, I guess. Uh, yeah. And then these have to cross. Yeah, see, that doesn't work. So let's go here, let's go to dismantle, let's dismantle this dude. And let's go to convey your and we need this to come up here like so. Producer, yep. So this goes down here. Oh, maybe we can fit this. Maybe we can't. Let's try. Consumer. Yep. Go here. Okay, so I can't. So I need a wide berth here. So let's get foundation here. We'll have this going straight, one gap and then one going here. So this has to be the limit. So one off of there is like so. Hmm. All right. So as the game progresses, seems like every small thing we do requires a lot of changes, which is amazing. Well, start off by saying it's amazing which it is but the other thing is that it takes us a long time each episode we do lesser and lesser in the overall scheme of things actually we're doing more but we're doing more to achieve marginal increments in efficiency so i mean come on in my book that's doing lesser actually it isn't but just for the sake of argument, let's just say that it is doing lesser. Conveyor. Two way. So that is going to spew everything out there really fast. Now I can get this goes out, comes in. And this will be over here, like so. They are out there, the hundred workmen that we have, fixing all the runways, making sure everything works. I am proud of them, so we shouldn't complain. But still, things are taking time, which is a pain. I think I might need to sketch out a proper plan on how I want things to work. The ideal queue length and whatnot for the new airport, which pretty soon we'll get into it. So this is what I'm going to do. The next couple of episodes, I'm going to let the game run. Uh, the next two episodes, I'm not going to make changes. Once I open these gates, I'm not going to make any changes until we run out the clock. And then after that, we are going to start with whatever money we've got. Maybe we should have a goal for how much money we need to get. Or maybe we need a goal for how much the airport value should be. It's 42 million. Shall we say 50 million? Once it reaches 50 million, let's open a new airport. Wow, minus 35, negative 35%. That's a huge amount. Let's get rid of all of this. I don't want it. All this is fine. All right. There's a lot of space wasted here, but it's fine. It's not not the end of the world so
this is connected already so we're just talking about one two three four five so out of that these two will be our immediate focus to connect and these three will be the standby gates that we'll connect later on uh, what else do i need i need hangers hangers large hangers yes this is precisely what i'm searching for It is at the taxiway. Two hangers should be fine. We drop some passengers, but it's not like we have rerouted any flights. So that's a good thing. Oh, my bad. By mistake, I turned off the air conditioner. Thought I turned it on. Seems like summer is coming in. Pretty hard. Okay, so this is all done. This hanger is done. How many vehicles do I have? I have five slots. So we are going to make one, two, three, four baggage and one fuel. And here we are going to have one, two baggage and three fuel. I'm assuming that we'll need more than one fuel truck to fill up the XL gates, which is why I'm getting so many fuel trucks. But as I said, all of these are assumptions. Let's see how it works out. Dismantle this, get the windows up here. We need the doors as well. And then I need to get rid of this this ugliness over here we can actually get the doors in right now one door here one door here and that's taken care of I don't think we can get this whole array in here as is. <coughs> so let's try to see if we can do that. So that's one, two, and then three, right? So that's one, two, and then three. So here it'll be one, two, and three over here like so oh the queues are going to be a problem even with sneaking queues this is going to be an issue okay we need to have some sort of sideways facing queues otherwise we are not going to be able to fit anybody here See, people are going all around them so i don't think we actually need the queues to be like go in and then go out i can stick the queues to the walls if i do that i might actually save some more space like if i'm able to stick the queues here to this corner stick the gates here to this corner I might be able to get away with certain things. We'll see. Let us see. I need uh, two over here. Like so. 
वन टू थ्री ओवर हियर यस एंड लेट्स गेट द फ्लोर स्टन One thing I could do is I could actually expand over here. It doesn't actually help me because there are two gates here. So even if I expand here, this gate will probably be taken care of by my expansion here. But these two gates will still need to be cramped in here. Hmm. Interesting issues. interesting indeed uh you will need to be assigned to gates so i'm going to assign you to all four those you assign you oh it's one to one assignment is it unassign so you can do this and you can do this one and this one i guess close and you my friend can do this one and this one that's it to actually need two of you well, let me just get two of you just in case let's go up this can be assigned you are already assigned here so i can assign you to this and this and this i can assign you to these four gates and now both of you are ready i'm going to rename you to x whatever the number is no it was z yes so you will be z you was z1 which means you will be z2 and you will be what's the large gate prefix i have large is l and then what else l and small this is reserve q what the hell is a q gate q is a small gate yeah that's not supposed to be q that's supposed to be r get c1 what the hell is get c oh these are the new gates which c1 e1 is the large gate that i'm trying to rename so we have z1 z2 we don't have large l m right the next one is m i did q why did i do q q is a small gate though so this will be m let's call you m m1 is q here Ah, uh, there it is. Wait. All those are O, but this is Q. Oh, yeah, this is the reserve over here. All right. All right, gotcha. So I'm gonna put a quick cut in this video. Do like and subscribe if you like the content I'm putting out. So do comment if you think anything is comment worthy. I'll be back in a quick bit with the next episode. Until then, take care now. Bye bye then.